A Tory councillor who spread disgusting criticism of Alex Salmond on social media has apologized, saying she did so unintentionally. And Jarvis, conservative and unionist councillor for Strathday on Perth and Kinross Council, posted links to a Facebook page titled, Alex Salmond is a diluted W asterisk asterisk asterisker. Read more, David Mandel argues against Scotland having a say in immigration she shared two posts about the possibility of an age increase for bus passes and about the walkers short bread, Union Jackery, apparently unaware that the Facebook page that she was linking contained an obscene reference to the former First Minister, as well as a picture of Transport Minister Hamza Yusuf photoshopped onto the body of former Iraqi Defense Minister Mohammed Saeed al sahaf the perpetrators, who are anonymous, allow posts calling Salman a traitor and AB asterisk 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 and items about the abolition of the Scottish Parliament. An expert on local government codes of conduct told The National, if it can be proven that Councillor Jarvis used a computer or social media page that is paid for by the council, then she could be in some trouble. It is no excuse to say that it was not intentional. All councillors are responsible for the material they produce, including retweets and shares on Facebook. The SNP leader on Perth Council, Councillor Dave Dugan, said, It is very interesting to note a page of this nature is something that Councillor Jarvis thinks is acceptable for an elected member to follow. She also clearly thinks it's acceptable to share material from this page in her capacity as a councillor, which is extremely unfortunate. Read more, Millionaire Tory MSP asks taxpayers to pay for tourist signs Councillor. Grant Lawing, also a Strathday representative and SNP deputy leader at Perth and Kinross Council, added, This is ridiculous and shocking to put these messages out there whether it is inadvertently or not. Although we don't share political views, we work together to benefit the Strathday ward. I am very disappointed she feels she has to go to this level and put things out there that are not factually correct, as well as accepting information from such a biased and derogatory site. Councillor Jarvis said, These pictures were sent to me and as they illustrated topics raised constantly with me, support for Scottish businesses and possible changes to free bus passes, I left them there. When I reviewed sent posts and messages I became aware of the original website where the posts had originated from and I removed them immediately. I can only say how sorry I am if people were upset as it was unintentional.